he's decompressing is fine. Now I do want to make a note of Mr. Wiedemer's calf. They do need a little work there. So uh, we'll, we can talk about that in the next video. Hey YouTube family, welcome back to another amazing episode of Accelerated Health. It's all like Donkey Kong. We are going to head over to Beat Personal Training and meet trainer extraordinaire, the Mr. Matt Wiedemer. Who? The Mr. Matt Wiedemer. We're gonna teach you guys how to strengthen your lower back muscles. One of the most common questions we're asked as chiropractors is how can I strengthen my lower back? Well, we're gonna teach you that today. Let me hit you with some knowledge. So stay tuned for that. And then after we teach you guys how to strengthen your low back, we're gonna head over to my office at Red Bank and we're gonna meet Brandy. Brandy's been a patient of mine for about seven years and she had very, very disabling back pain and sciatica pain, which means pain down the leg. You're gonna hear her very emotional story and um, I think it's going to inspire you guys. So stay tuned, we're gonna have an amazing episode. Good morning everybody, it's Dr. Baker. I'm here with Dr. Paul Baker and trainer extraordinaire, Mr. Matt Wiedemer. Good morning guys. Good morning, how are you? Doing how's great. That? Hey, what's going on over here, Mr. Wiedemer? What is this thing? Well, it's called a reverse hyperextension. <laughs> You're crazy, man. And we think this is probably the best exercise for lower back for a couple reasons. So. Um, number one, when you get on here, the first thing you notice is you're going to decompress your spine because you're in a horizontal plane, so you're laying flat down. Um, the back is what we call avascular, it means it tendons and ligaments, so it doesn't get a lot of blood supply. So part of the reason chiropractic is so effective is you get blood and nutrients into the uh, discs. This is going to do the same thing. So as I, I, I would always, if you've ever swung a kettlebell, kind of like a kettlebell swing, but this motion right here creates inhibition. And as you lower the weight, you rotate your sacrum, which will open your spinal column. And then as I raise the weight, I pump blood and spinal fluid into the spinal column. Yeah. So what he's doing here is on the way down here, guys, he's decompressing the spine. And on the way up, you can see these ginormous muscles right here, Mr. Wiedemer. Okay. Wow, these, these those are, are impressive. I don't think I've seen paraspinals that big. I always call it massive. Sometimes they say huge, not a bad one. These are called the erector spinae. So just like the word says, is these erect the spine. And you can see he's recruiting the muscles here and on the way down, he's decompressing his spine. Now I do want to make a note of Mr. Wiedemer's cast. They do need a little work here. Oh! For athletes, is a great, uh, it's pure hip extension. So glutes, hamstrings, uh, a lot of areas that most people lag for housewives at home, mm -hmm. right? What's the tone their glutes and their butt? Oh, geez, look at the butt on that. It's a great exercise to do it, so it makes you look better, perform better, right. it makes you healthier. So the greater housewives of Cincinnati need to come see Mr. Wiedemer, That's the right. trainer extraordinaire. That's right. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed that demonstration of the reverse hyperextension machine. That's one of the primary pieces of equipment that we use in all of our offices to help strengthen and stabilize the lumbar spine. I want that. I'm all jacked up. I want to get another workout in. Let's go. Now we're going to head over to the Red Bank office and meet Brandy. Hey YouTubers, family. Hope you guys are having a great day. Say hi, Brandy. How you doing? Hello there. So this is Brandy Stewart. We met, how many years ago did we meet? Yeah, I think it's probably been about seven. Seven yeah, years seven ago, years yeah. Years. It seems like so long ago. <laughs> so I want you to tell our viewers how dis disabling your low back pain and leg pain were. Tell them how bad you were. Uh, um, first of all, um, I was, I was, I couldn't walk. I was in pain. It hurt to lay down, it hurt to stand. Um, my range of motion was off. Uh, I, I came here literally crying in tears. Yeah. Um, I, I, yeah, I remember the first day that we met, you were actually literally crying yes. when I was doing your exam. Yes, sir. Yes. I, was, I was in pain. I, I, the pain was so unbearable. I was at the point, I, I went to all kind of uh, NOVA care. I, I went to the hospital. Nobody could help me. They told me that um, basically, good luck, you know, uh, basically saying, you know, they ain't going to help for me. Yeah. And I happened to see um, his advertisement on, a, on TV on a Saturday morning, and it was actually him and his brother. Some some said, give him a try. So I was just laying there and I'm like, oh, maybe I ain't gonna I ain't gonna try it. 
But I, I wind up, I said, let me go with the work. And I was so much in pain. I said, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go. And I went and I told uh, Dr. Paul about my pain. And, and, and he said, look, I'm gonna do what I can. I'm gonna lay, I'm gonna lay my hands on you. And then I'm gonna go from there. He said, we gonna get you together. It's gonna take some time. But he said, I'm gonna do what I gotta do to get you together. And uh, I can tell you, this man has a hand of God. He has. He, he does. I he that. does have that, and I'm so grateful for him. I'm able to run. I'm able to jump. I, I'm working out now. Actually, my life is a whole lot better. Welcome to the good life. And I can actually lay down and go to bed and sleep at night. Okay. That's and awesome. I just stay up on my treatments. And like yeah. I said, Dr. Pye, I just want to tell you thank you for everything that you have done for me these seven years. I'm getting emotional, but I'm just saying you really. You really did a big impact on my life, man. Yeah. You just don't know what you've done. Well, I'm, I'm, first of all, I'm honored to be your chiropractor. Yes, sir. It is emotional because, like, when you change people's lives like this, this is a big deal. And yes, a lot is. of people are yes. suffering like you. So yes. I Every just day. want to thank you for taking the time to share your testimonial. Yes, sir. And uh, I'm just I'm so glad I could help you. I, I couldn't pick a better place, a better person. Uh, the people friendly oh my god I, I feel so welcome every time i come in i tell these guys my life story they don't judge this is a, a non-judgmental place if you know this is actually the place to be this man has changed my life physically that's awesome thank you so much thank you god you know i love you i love you too it's contest time so we have a really cool contest for the first person that can guess how much b12 you need daily if you're local, you can come to any of our clinics and receive a free B12 shot. Or if you're not local, we'll send you our best B12 supplement. So this is exciting. So the first one to guess how much B12 you need per day will win the prize. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Accelerated Health. Make sure to subscribe and smash that notifications button and then you're to be notified of the next week's episode. Also, make sure to like and comment on the videos. We look forward to seeing you guys next week.